Hi lovely viewers, it's me again your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. I want to say something that many of you uh, uh, are going to be shocked about but it's very important that you know so that you don't waste your time when you talk about power in africa so long as the whole africa is concerned we are in the level two so if on uh, if you see any prophet in africa that is doing well ask that person question ask him do you know see one they will tell you if you see any witch doctor that is very powerful that is respected in Africa, ask that person, do you know Siawan? Or do you know Godfather? They will tell you. So if you go behind me to say, let's get a witch doctor that will come and destroy what Siawan did in, in our party in this, they will still come to me to collect power to destroy it. <laughs> so I'm going to tell you what happened uh, with peer people that went to Malawi to seek for spiritual power from somebody that comes to me to collect supernatural power. So long as Africa is concerned, I am the dawn of power, the dawn corneal of power. It's not a story story. It's not a prayer and fasting story. So long as Africa is concerned, and especially here in Southern Africa, so long as power is concerned, I am the dawn corneal of power. I don't have competition. If you go to any witch doctor that is very strong here in Southern Africa, and ask him about Siawan, he will tell you. If you go to any pa any pastor, or any bishop, any prophet that is doing wonders here in Southern Africa, ask about Siawan, they will tell you. So if you go behind me, no, Siawan has put confusion in our party. Siawan is disorganizing our party. Let's go and get somebody that will neutralize it. There is no one that will neutralize it. Even if you even if you bring all the witch doctors together, ask anybody. Ask my church people. Here in my house is where witch doctors come to collect power to help people. <laughs> so when go, when they are talking about going to Malawi to get a witch doctor, if he did it, I was going to kill him. So forget about that story. I'm going to come and talk about this. I don't want to start talking about it. I want, I'm going to talk about it later. And you are praying. What type of prayer are you praying? Those are useless prayer. If I catch you praying that prayer, you are dead. It, it doesn't go anywhere. They have done prayer for me. After all this thing that they did against me, after all this prayer they did on me, after those prayers didn't work, what did they do? They went to Malawi. Of recent, they went to Malawi. The witch doctor in Malawi. Not knowing that that witch doctor also come to me to collect power. The power he used to heal people. The power he used to see people's problem. The power he used to give people to, to, to win Lotto. The power he used to give people to win election is power that he collects from me, Siawan. And when they arrived there, that man told them, I'm telling you, I'm going to show you evidence. That man told them to say, Siawan has destroyed your party. And there is nothing we can do. That man told them that next year election, they are going to lose it. And that man told them to say, cause confusion so that there won't be election. If there will ever be election, we are going to lose the election. That's what which doctor said in Malawi that made them started panicking. Let me tell you the plan, what they want to do now. UPND, I know that you are watching me. Uh, NDC, I know that you are watching me. Uh, 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 uh. All that political MMD, I know that you are watching me. All the political parties, I know that you are watching me. This is what PF is planning to do. They want to use this COVID. They want to use it to postpone next year's election because that guy has told them that they will not win the election because of CR1. I swear upon Godfather. He told them that you are not going to win. No, even no matter what I would do for you, you are not going to win election. All you have to do, find a way to postpone it. And the PF is going to postpone. Mark my word. PF is going to postpone the election. Mark my word. They are about to postpone it. They are going to use COVID to postpone it. And another option is that they want to use violence, anarchy to postpone it. 
like what was about to happen in a, in a, in a, during the gassing of the people those are the the type of thing that they want to do they want to use it to postpone the election because they have been told that you are not going to win this election i swear i swear upon god father when i say something when i say something and swear upon god father believe me that is how it is i want akainde chilema to hear my voice i want uh, uh, nefas mumba to hear my voice i want shimbakambi to hear my voice I want Chilufia uh, Tayali to hear my voice. I want, uh, I want, uh, I want, uh, what is his name? I want uh, 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 Sefia Chishimba to hear my voice. I want, uh, I want uh, Mr. Charles Banda to hear my voice. I want all the opposition leaders to hear my voice. PF eh, is about to postpone next year's election. They are going to use COVID. That is why. The more they are saying the cases are increasing, the more they are campaigning and gathering people in number so that they will keep announcing. They will keep announcing results. They are going to keep announcing it until next year. That is where it will get to next year. They will say, no, this year there will not be election because of COVID. Take note. If I can advise you, the, 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 the people of uh, the, the opposition leaders, Please, from now going on, if it's possible, unite yourself. Unite yourself. Bring in people that are going to audit the COVID result that they are announcing. Because they are, they are, they, they, the, the results are going to be increasing now. To put fear in, in, the, in the mind of the people of Zambia. They want to put fear in the mind of people of Zambia. So that by next year, when they say we are postponing the election, nobody is going to argue with it. They will say the number has increased excessively. If COVID is really, really in Zambia, the Minister of Health cannot gather people without social distancing. Here in South Africa, where I am, if you want to go and transact in Zambia, they will give you, if you want to go and transact in the bank, they will give you, uh, they will give you line. They will say there is other social distancing because there is COVID that is happening in South Africa. But in Zambia, the minister that's supposed to be in forefront protecting people from getting COVID is the one that is gathering people so that they can get more COVID for postponement of election next year. People of Zambia, listen to me. People of Zambia, listen to me. This is what is about to happen. You are going to see it for yourself election is about to be postponed using violence if you are a, a upnd kada that which doctor has already told me everything he told the pf be very careful because they want to also use violence when you are campaigning they come with violence leave them they want to use violence they want people to start killing each other so that they will say oh because of violence we are postponing next year's election this is exactly what i received from the witch doctor in malawi because he consults from me because i am the jacoban of power in africa because he get power from me he told me everything pf has lost next year's election and it's likely that there will not be election using covid if they were serious about even if you don't want to believe me even if you don't you don't love cr1 even if you hate cr1 please believe me on what I'm telling you now. If, if it doesn't happen, then you know that I'm not here one. If Corona is really, really serious in Zambia, a minister of health was going to be the one in forefront protecting people from getting Corona. But he is in forefront gathering people without social distancing so that there will be a lot and a lot, a lot and a lot of Corona cases open your ears you are going to be hearing huge numbers of corona cases it's just they are hearing me now they know that i have exposed their plan they may reduce the number but corona is not it's not it's nowhere a threat in zambia but they are going to use it next year eddie galungu no he has been told that he has lost the election but they want to postpone it i have spoken to you uh, 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 the people of Zambia, the opposition in Zambia, I don't want you, I don't want your money. I don't want anything from you. I am blessed. I am so blessed. When I say I am blessed, I know what I'm talking about. I am blessed beyond measure. I don't want any money from opposition leader. I don't want any money from anybody. I don't want anything from anybody. But take my advice. 
once you hear pf say we are we are we are planning to think about uh, postponing next year's election i want take to the street and protest believe me take to the street and protest if they want to kill you prepare to die for your country prefer prepare to die for your people Pre prepare to protect your people because pf cannot even go one more year destroying zambia the way they have destroyed zambia i have said my own i have said my own i have talked to the people of zambia if you have ears listen to me if you know that you are a zambian and you are watching this clip make sure that you share it so that even pf people those Thou people, thou idiot, we, we hear that their plan has been exposed. Next year's election must proceed. If you want to use COVID, then put a measure. Be, the, be a lead, lead with example. Stop campaigning. Stop gathering people in numbers. Stop it. I have told you, as a Jacoban, what is most important is that those of you that are watching me, those of you that watch me know that I may be called a satanist, I may be called this and that. I never come here to lie to the people. I come here to say the truth. And a satanist can never say the truth. I want to, I want to, uh, I want to hear from you. I want to get your questions. Let me answer your questions. What are you going to do about the witch doctor? I'm not going to do anything. I don't hate witch doctors. Witch doctors come to me to collect powers. Same the way pastor come to me to collect powers. I don't hate anybody. I don't criticize anybody's job. But I've told you what your leaders we are planning. What your leaders are going to do. So be careful so that when it happens, you will know that Siawan has already said it. Like the way I've been saying it from the beginning. You know that Siawan has said it. Papa, how do you give a witch doctor power? Of course. Is using it to help people. There are people that go there, they have HIV, it heal them. Cancer, it heal them. Once you are using the power to help people, why not give it to you? Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.